It's no accident that Genesis's wing logo closely resembles the badge on a Bentley. This similarity underscores the ambitious mission of the upstart Korean luxury brand to join the elite ranks of prestigious automakers that have built their reputations over the past century. Although Genesis hasn't yet achieved household name status, brand awareness and sales have significantly risen since 2020. That was the year the Genesis GV80 debuted and quickly became a hit, earning a spot on our 10 best list and boosting the brand's total U.S. sales from 5,099 in 2020 to 15,301 in 2021. Now, as it enters its fifth model year for 2025, the Genesis GV80 receives updates that enhance the midsize luxury SUV even further. Fresh new looks, same great ride. At first glance, the new GV80's changes are subtle. Its signature split headlights and large pentagonal grille remain, but a closer look reveals a new twin-spoke mesh design that adds depth to the grille, along with new microlens array headlights borrowed from the flagship Genesis G90 sedan. The front end also features larger air intakes and a faux skid plate, giving it a wider and sportier appearance. While the upcoming GV80 Coupe will introduce a 409 horsepower V, 6 with an electric supercharger later this year, the rest of the lineup continues with the standard 300 horsepower turbocharged 2.5 liter inline 4 and the optional 375 horsepower twin turbo 3.5 liter V6. Both engines are paired with an 8 speed automatic transmission, and all wheel drive remains standard. We drove the top tier GV80 Prestige with the V6. It doesn't match the raw power or roar of the V8 engines in the BMW X5 M60i and Porsche Cayenne S, but those competitors are at least $10,000 more expensive than this Genesis. While we wish the GV80 had more power off the line and when overtaking slower vehicles on two-lane highways, the 3.5T smooth operation and the transmission's responsive shifting make for a satisfying experience overall. In our previous tests, AV, 6, powered GV80 reached 60 miles per hour in 5.3 seconds, and another model achieved 24 miles per gallon on our 75 miles per hour fuel economy route. However, for 2025, the GV80 3.5T's EPA estimates have decreased from 18 miles per gallon city and 23 miles per gallon highway to 16 miles per gallon city and 22 miles per gallon highway. The GV80 3.5T Prestige comes standard with 22-inch wheels, adaptive dampers, and an electronic limited-slip differential. Despite the large wheels and limited sidewall cushioning, the ride remains gentle and quiet, underscoring the SUV's luxury credentials. Genesis has added more soundproofing material and thicker laminated glass to make the back seat even quieter. The serene cabin and cohesive controls contribute to a relaxing driving experience, perhaps a bit too relaxing. While we appreciate the isolation from external noise and road imperfections, we'd like more steering feedback to better enjoy the SUV's athleticism. Hopefully, the sportier coupe will address this and offer stickier summer tires as an option instead of the standard all-seasons. A snazzier cabin with better features. Every GV80 now features a redesigned interior with a 27.0-inch OLED screen dominating the dashboard, showing that Genesis is staying current with technology trends. We appreciate how the new display seamlessly integrates instrumentation and infotainment, though we wish for more gauge design options. The infotainment system is easier to use than before, with the screen now responding to touch inputs and the old click wheel on the center console replaced by a more intuitive rotary knob. Additionally, volume and tuning functions are now controlled by knobs, replacing rollers, located higher on the center stack. Most importantly, Genesis finally offers wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, addressing one of our few minor complaints with the previous GV80. This cordless connection will be available later this year through a free over-the-air update. Genesis doesn't have the long heritage of other legacy luxury brands, but it stands out with unique styling and exceptional execution. The GV80's build quality exceeds expectations for its price point, with evident attention to details such as the stitched patterns on the door panels and the feel of the switchgear. For 2025, the GV80 introduces more two-tone interior color schemes, including earth brown slash smoky green and glacier white slash ultramarine blue. Our GV80 featured the latter combination paired with the new store green paint, creating a near-perfect spec. 
It didn't include the available third row, which is offered only on the less expensive 3.5T Advanced model and is generally too small to be practical. We had mixed feelings about the previous GV80's two-spoke steering wheel, which has now been replaced with a new three-spoke design featuring better button placement and a richer look thanks to the new Genesis emblem. The center console has been improved with a fingerprint scanner that allows you to start the car without the digital key and larger cup holders that no longer have a space-stealing cover. There's also a new covered cubby below the revamped climate controls, which houses a wireless charging pad with better visibility. The top-spec Prestige trim includes all the latest features. This now includes a Bang & Olufsen sound system that replaces the old 1050-watt Lexicon stereo with a 1400-watt setup featuring a Biasonic function for adjusting the sound profile without distortion, an upgrade we didn't know we needed. Additionally, there's a new Mood Curator inspired by the G90, which plays atmospheric music, activates ambient lighting, closes the window shades, triggers the fatigue-fighting driver's seat, and emits a cabin fragrance, stimulating four of your five senses. All that's missing is a taste component, unless you want to lick the steering wheel. Since its debut, the Genesis GV80 has been a standout among mid-size luxury SUVs. It was already our top choice, and now it's even better thanks to a series of mostly small but meaningful improvements. The GV80 remains refined, stylish, and packed with technology, all at a price that doesn't come close to the six-figure territory of its competitors. The four-cylinder 2.5T still starts at $59,050, while the GV80 3.5T now has a base price of $75,150, nearly $9,000 more than before. This increase is largely due to newly standard features that were previously part of the $7,350 advanced package. Meanwhile, the V6 Prestige's price of $80,650 has only increased by $2,455, making it a bargain compared to its top-tier rivals. Returning to the Bentley-like badge, the refreshed GV80 now sports a metal emblem instead of plastic. It's a minor change that might go unnoticed, yet it highlights Genesis's ongoing efforts to elevate its status. This attention to detail is why Genesis and the GV80 continue to impress. 2025 Genesis GV80 – More polished than ever The 2025 Genesis GV80 doesn't dramatically reinvent the wheel, but it does refine the formula that made its predecessor such a compelling choice in the midsize luxury SUV segment. Subtle exterior tweaks keep the GV80 looking sharp, but the biggest changes occur inside the cabin. Here's a closer look at what to expect. Tech-centric interior The most striking upgrade for 2025 is the interior. Gone are the previous GV80's traditional gauges. In their place sits a massive 27.0-inch OLED screen dominating the dashboard. This single unit combines the instrument cluster and infotainment system, creating a sleek, modern feel. While some reviewers would have preferred more customization options for the gauges, there's no denying the overall impression of technological sophistication, comfort, and refinement. The 2025 GV80 retains its reputation for exceptional comfort. High-quality materials and a spacious interior create a luxurious environment for driver and passengers alike. New features like adjustable ambient lighting and a wider range of seat adjustments further personalize the experience.